Welcome to another quick video from Friendly Computing. So in this video we're going to show you how you can clone your um, an SD card to another SD card. So in our instance we're using a micro SD card in a Raspberry Pi. And what we want to do is to make a clone of that so that if we get corruption on that SD card uh, we don't have to go along and rebuild all of the software again. So um, the first thing that you want to do is to um, make sure that you've got a card reader. So in our instance we've got a, a card reader that connects to USB 3. Um, and in that card reader we've got both of our SD cards mounted. The next thing that we want to do is um, use a piece of software that um, is free, certainly for, uh, for cloning um, SD cards, and that is this piece of software called EasyOS uh, Partition Master. So we're going to go ahead and open this piece of software. Close that offer down and in here um, we're going to close everything down and we want to go in and make sure that we can see our disks so in our instance we have got an 8 gig card and we're going to be cloning it to a 16 gig um, SD card so what you want to do is to select the disk that you want to clone so in our instance it is this 8 gig uh, SD card and we want to click on clone we want to do disk 3 we're going to select disk mode because that's going to take all of the partitions so make sure you select the right one so in our instance we've got this 8 gig card here uh, we want to double check to make sure that we've got um, the right one selected so that we don't overwrite uh, it As you can see here we've got the two partitions and we're going to select once we've selected the disk we're going to click on next and we are then going to select the target disk which is disk 4 which is our 16 gig card we're going to click on next and then make sure that you've got the right card in there again clone will permanently wipe all the data on the target disk but ours is formatted and blank anyway so we're going to say continue it's going to show our layout and we're going to select here uh, we're going to say as it says here auto fit it to the disk so source disk is the 8 gig card destination is the 16 gig card and then we're going to click on OK and that is going to go off and clone it's going to add it to the job queue so let's have a look at that as you can see up here it's waiting to execute so we can go ahead and clone disk 3 to disk 4 okay and there we go so that will then go through and clone all the data for us So once that uh, clone is completed, it will take a, quite, a, quite a while depending on the size of the uh, SD cards that you've got. Just click on finish, you can close that window down, close that down and then the next thing you want to do is you want to uh, eject your SD cards properly. So come down and release that. So I'm going to click on eject E drive, go back, that's actually ejected all of them. remove your SD cards and then um, you can use your original or the clone in your device so in our instance we're, we're using these for our Raspberry Pi um, so as I said you can make sure that you eject those properly and then they can be used in your system uh, if you've got any questions just leave a comment in the section below and we aim to answer all of them but uh, just want to take this opportunity to say thanks for watching